There we go. Hello, everybody. My name is Regular Gamer. Alex, welcome to Strange Toilet 2 The Forgotten Shit. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so, a few a days back, or it might have been a week back, I played Strange Toilet 1, and it was. It was fun. It was pretty funny, and actually got me a few scares that didn't have got me. But it was pretty fun still. And I found out that the game actually has a sequel. There's a second one. So, of course, I'm going to play it. This one has, uh, apparently from what the page says on Instagram.io, it says it has three endings. So, you guys know me. Let's try and get them all. But first, let's try and at least get one of them. Toilets. The trains. Don't use display toilets. Oh, that Welcome was loud. Welcome in my toilet store. How can I help you? Hello there. Your name is Jack, right? Well, let's just say I'm looking for something really specific. I think there's the same okay. voice actors Look from the over previous there. one. Pick one and get out of here. We have Ben, we have inverted toilets, and my favorite, the most ecological toilet in the world. <laughs> what the what? hell, dude? When I said I'm looking for something specific, I meant one particular toilet. Okay. Here are the details of contract. Your goal is to find the golden toilet for me. <laughs> Ain't no way I'm doing this. What do you need a golden toilet for anyways? Cause it's made of fucking gold, idiot. I will pay you. And I'll let you pet my cat. Cats? <laughs> That's what gets him is a cat. <laughs> yep, and the man's like, say no more, you need Just go into the castle. I like the little comic book stall has. Of course the damn doors are locked. Hey look, you just bought a few comics really just yesterday. Go down there. Including a mm. zombie Sherlock Holmes yeah, one. Ain't no way I'm going down there. <clears throat> I like comics, what can I say? I mean I literally have uh where I'll show you guys in a second. I literally just got some comics the other day. Yeah, let me go grab them real quick. Yeah, I literally just bought some comics today, including one Sherlock Holmes zombie comic called Victorian Undead. Because why not? And then I bought a big one, which is... Invincible! Because, well, I love the show a lot, so... Check out the comics. I like comics. <laughs> uh, what? Where am I? Ooh, sensitivity is a bit on the high side. There we go. It's so old that there's not even a trace of any electrical activity here. I wonder if at least there'll be any chandelier in the castle. This place chandelier? Looks like it has been here for ages. Well, yes, it's an old castle. Door is locked. That needs like a valve or something. Or a crank. What is that? What the? Um. Found a golden toilet? <laughs> Okay, shift is sprint. Normal, normal button schematics. We're in the dungeons of this area. Can I grab any of these? Oh, I can. Hold at least to throw brick. Oh, okay. Uh, what can I throw that? Definitely not there. Brick, brick. Oh, wait, can I do it at the lock over here? Well, even if I were able to do it for the lock. No. Well, it was worth a try. What could I throw it at? What's that? I don't know what that is. Hmm. Oh, wait. Ali, you. Okay, I think I undershot it. Let's try this again. Buckets! Literally, oh, the brick is stuck up there. Silky, huh? 
literally buckets. But now I lost a brick. The brick is forever gone. R.I.P. Brick. Rizuku came to brick up the walls at the request of the mayor of the city. The entire castle is supposed to be restored, but the mayor went bankrupt earlier due to his $500 plus, dollar plus program. The work in the castle ended prematurely. We've been preparing for this for a long time, and when we were ready with all the equipment brought inside, we received information about a change in the mayoral candidate. The new mayor did not give order to renovate the castle, so we were forced to return. In act of protest, we left most equipment here. We simply don't feel like carrying it back. If this message is someone, enjoy exploring the castle. Maybe find something useful. So you're telling me that I can find some stuff here? That's not possible. Oh, I think it might just be possible. Of course, I could do so with a plunger. Oh, another golden toilet. At least I don't have to actually look at the toilet over there. Okay, so I got a plunger. What can I wait? I think this wall will break easily. I don't have a brick anymore. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I see the valve. Come on. There we go. Place a valve here. Button matching. Come on. There we go. I get a plunger out. You never know when you're gonna need a plunger. Okay, I thought. <laughs> I was preparing for some of those lockers to open. I thought none of them was gonna open, and then it's suddenly right at the end. Of course. Who skeleton was that I saw? Hello, stranger. Hello there. Golden toilet. Jeez. That got me. Damn. I was preparing for something to happen with a locker, because that's what they did in the last game. And still, it got me. There's a random pop-out skeleton. Whew. That gave me a heart attack. Hello there. You good? You have key? Can I have key? I think he might want something. Do you want plunger? Who doesn't want a plunger? I like to die as a free man. It probably won't be given to me. It's all the fault of that pig bastard. During the reign of the pig king, all residents of nearby village were unable to use toilets in a normal manner. Please, dear stranger, bring me some toilet paper if that's my only wish. I heard someone shitting upstairs some time ago. So you can't shit ah. yourself anymore? That's fucked up, buddy. That is. We got we got honor the man. We need to get that two ply. The man needs his two ply. We got a wine cellar now. I'm trying to keep my eyes open for any more of those golden toilets. Ugh. What the fuck is that? Shit. Like actual shit. It's literally a giant pile of. Oh, great. Yep, that's a toilet up there. Thanks for the hammer. I don't know how much longer he will keep me in suspense. I have to hurry up. This guy is gutsy. He holds people in this castle makes them do strange things. He said to swallow this hammer. Otherwise, he'll stick up my ass and pull it out the other side. Oh, God. Okay. If you're reading this match, you probably already know how it ended. Yep. Oh, that's really bad. Yeah, that's just... I am sorry, my guy. Jesus. Wait, is there any golden toilets over here? Gotta keep my eyes open. Always gotta be on the lookout. But at least now I got a hammer. I know what we need to do it do with it. Not fat. We need uh, the key for that skeleton for that, but so we need toilet paper. I'm gonna use this for this. Ali yo. And there we go. 
I see a crowbar. Okay, can I go all Gordon Freeman on someone? I, I think I seen their golden toilet. Aha, uh -huh, I'm doing good with those collecting. But I actually don't know how many there are to collect, so that's... Well, at least I'm hoping I'm doing well. So I got a crowbar. Question is, what is crowbar for? Well, let's go find out. Skeleton man's that way, so maybe... Something with over here? Yeah, that's gross. So that's a definite no. Do I need to shove this up there? Oh, please don't tell me that's what I need to do. Well, that was a whole mess of events. I'm just gonna take the toilet paper and leave. I don't know how the, the plunger helped with that all. I, I don't even... I don't know. Thank you, Skeletor. Thank you, Padlocky. Okay, so we got the key for a padlock. That's not a good sound. Oh, the crowbar's for this. Duh. Whoa. That's locked. Unlocked. I see a golden toilet up there. Open this up first. No one's hiding in there. Good. Key. A hotel room key. Hotel. But first... Gotta get that golden toilet. Okay, nothing in there. Oh. This one also has a hotel room key. Okay, nothing in there. Nothing up there, that's a lantern. Oh, well, an oil lamp, I think. Hotel room five key. Okay, let's see if we go open four first. Always check these first. Aha. Uh -huh. Thank you, hotel room key four. Nothing in there. This hotel was dreadful. I couldn't stand it in the guest room. All the time, our strangers thumps and screams as if ghosts were roaming the corridors. My sleep was completely ruined by those eerie sounds. It was terrifying and chilling to the bone. I promised myself never to return to that cursed place. Okay. That a bone, you say? This castle is haunted. That's exactly how I imagined it. To the bone, he said. To the bone. Oh, I check those. I saw it. I saw my own eyes. It's horrible. I barely escaped my life. Don't even think about getting near it. Now I believe you're strong enough to kill with an axe, a hammer, or anything else. But you're dead wrong. It will simply rip it from your hands and shove it deep into your ass or just smash you with it. Great! That's not the only reason to be afraid. This creature can belch so strongly that the floor will tremble. Okay. And on top of that, this creature stinks like nothing in this world. It'll dissolve in its stench. Watch out for yourself. Don't tell me it's going to be like a shit all right, monster. Alright, alright, I get it. I shouldn't get close to that thing. <laughs> I mean... Who would have thought, if I ever came across it, of course, I'd give it a big hug right away. Yeah, that's totally how it works. Obviously, I'd be running away from it like crazy. I'm not that stupid after all. This is true. But you also gotta remember, I am stupid. 
we go. I don't know if I like that. Nothing, nothing. Hotel room key six. What just happened? Um... I see the golden toilet, but I think I'm- maybe I should. Yep, even I knew that was gonna happen. Oh, but we're still alive. Huh. Okay, well now we got door number six. Okay, so four, five, so six is over. No, wait, no, this is six. Like I again to seven. Or is that eight? Who's next door? Eight is next door. Nothing in there. Nothing up here. Get rid of these wooden planks. Okay, I guess someone wanted bunk beds, but in a different way. Nothing in there. Oh. Always oh, hidden behind a door. Well, I still need one more key. Well, it's probably through here. Oh, okay. Again with this running skeleton. Uh, I, I didn't mean to. I'm gonna just go back over here. Room seven. Okay, let's do that first, then we'll go through these. I don't know what's gonna be in seven, but we'll go look. And I'm still trying to keep my eyes open for any golden toilet collectibles. Oh, behind that's the debris that we just saw. Is that walkie-talkie? The castle was a fascinating place. You discovered secret patches that no one knew about before. However, our expedition had to end prematurely due to the presence of a mysterious creature lurking in the vicinity. The whole situation alarmed us, and amidst the chaos, we forget the taste of wine we had heard about. Unfortunately, one of our companions was injured during the escape. We hope that the other explorers will have the chance to continue our work and uncover the entire history of this extraordinary place. Best regards, Castle Explorers Team. So other explorers have been here, but they had to stop because of that creature? Not a fan of wine myself. But the castle's secrets and history are too tempting to give up. I'll Understandable. Be cautious, but I'm determined to uncover the full story of this place. Looking around, make sure there's no golden. Aha! 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 There we go. And with that, that's another golden toilet for me. How many of those are in this to collect? Well, this is this is a lot bigger, a lot more bigger than uh, the previous strange toilet game. I mean, strange toilet first one was just one apartment. This is full on castle, many different areas, a lot more exploration. I, exploration, I like it. A lot more skeletons. I wonder who has a bone to pick with. I'm sorry, that was a terrible pun. I apologize. Oh, wait, what? Oh, he's a skeleton ghost. He's a skeleton ghost. Okay. 
I mean, if they could do it in Corpse Bride, I don't see why they can't do it here. <gasps> Go ahead, you dad. This is going overwhelming for me. I wanted this place to be live again like it used to be. Recently, I'll put my guest here, rooms here, and a bar where I served high quality wine. Of course, the wine was not produced by me. It was something left over from over a hundred years ago. Some barrels in the cellar have survived, came to the point I didn't have. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I didn't have... have enough money to sustain this place for long enough. LA of how sus is just all in caps there. I went bankrupt and this place will be banned forever. It's just a big ruin. This place must have been full of life and charm in the past. I might have oh, it's a flask. Some interesting stories here. Well, let's make sure we're not missing any sort of golden, uh... toilets. I got a flask. I'll probably get some wine in it. Make sure to look under tables, make sure we don't miss any sort of golden toilets. Excuse me. Oh, we need to get a drink for the ghost skeleton over here. I gave here to this wonderful wine. Unfortunately, I arrived late. When I got here, the place was already abandoned. No one ever let me taste this wine. I won't leave it until I try. The flash should be somewhere in the bar. Fine. I'll bring you some. Yeah, let the ghost have a drink. He might be a ghost skeleton without any actual... Without any actual organs to taste wine, but you never know. Aha! Nice try! Trying to be sneaky. Okay. Let's go and find some... Nope, okay, not through there. Um, for here. Oh, do I need to go all the way down to the very beginning area of those cellars to get wine? I think that's what we need to do. Go to the very beginning area. Because over there is where we saw the wine cellar. Well, not exactly a wine cellar, but where they kept the wine. The barrels of wine. So let's head back to the beginning area. Come on, give us some wine. There we go. The skeleton ghost will be happy. Ah, Mr. Skeleton Ghost. We got you your wine, good sir. Oh, there he goes. We'll see you later, mate. I guess he unlocked the door for us. Just one quick look around, just to make sure I'm not missing any sort of golden uh, toilets. Make sure there's none on top of the piano either. Nope, I'm not seeing any more, so let's go on. Ooh. Ah, come on. Well, I guess that's where he died. Never golden toil for me. Not for key. Bar entrance key. Oh, they really are amping up the jump scares for this one. They all seem to be centered more around uh, skeletons. There we go. Okay, can't open that door. Oh, it's a library. The Golden Turd. A through F. G through L. M through R and S through Z. Okay. Let's make sure, let's look around for any sort of golden toilets. I see levers. Uh -huh. How many of these have I collected by now? List of books. Morgan Rosendale, Jeffrey Lockwood, oh, oh wait. Morgan Rosendale, Mystic Manuscript, Jeffrey Lockwood, Quest for the Grail, uh, Seraphina of Zephyr, Secrets of Zephyr Castle, 
and Carlos Fairwood, Chronicles of Avalon. Are we trying to find these specific books? Or in that order? Okay, but then there's that follow-up question, which order is it in? Is it in the order of offers? Or book? I guess I'll go with book first, so MQSC. Pick one as a Q. Oh, wait. Okay, so if that's the case, then nope, it's... It's offers, not... Okay. Yep, it's offers, not book. Okay, so... Boom. That's for Z, and... Last one's Carlos. Aha, there's always a hidden bookshelf. Leading us to somewhere new. Is there anything I can do with a painting? Nope. Just always make sure. I swear! Okay, let me make sure there's no toilets over here. Yep. Up, I see this one. Yeah, I saw a little bit of gold in the corner there. Big keyboard in. Okay. Wait, does it mean I can play piano now? Because if so, then I could just go over here and just play the piano. Let's see if it works. Oh wow, it's actually gonna work. <laughs> I hate everything. I hate everything. Seriously, you, you just rickrolled me. Oh, god dang it, now I got that song stuck in my head. Thank you, Rick Astley. Never gonna give you up, never gonna... Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna look around. I swear. I'm not expecting to get rickrolled in this game. I'm expecting it to be like a puzzle and we get like a key or something. <sighs> not that Rick Astley's never going to give you up. Never skeleton. Last moments. Got too close to that creature. It poisoned me of acid. Feels like it's eating me from the inside out. The pain's unbearable. Lost my friend earlier. Crushed under debris and now I'm facing my own nightmare. Terrified it's coming too fast. Can't put into woods what that creature is. Run away. If someone finds this, warn them this castle is merciless. Don't stay here. Goodbye. Oh, that must have been terrifying. The creature with acid and the accident with the ceiling. I need to be careful with every step here. The warning in the note makes me even more curious about what this castle holds. I have to be cautious and wise <laughs> to avoid the fate of other explorers. Okay, well... Oh, golden toilet. May I've collected a lot of those now. Oh, I didn't mean to use that. I didn't need to use that. Okay. I can only carry one at a time. Oh, seriously, a golden turd. Was that always there, or did I just not notice it till now? Okay, well, before we go to the golden toilet over there. Let me go over here so I make sure I'm not missing anything or missing any golden toilets. Nothing, nothing. Nothing, nothing. Nothing, nothing. Nope, nada. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Nothing at all. Okay, well, if all those gone. Oh, wait, let's make sure there's nothing behind. But, yep. Called that one. Nice try. Now we climb up. How to fight? Uh oh. 
That's not something you like to see. All your items are useless, like the note in the hotel said. So how to defeat him? It's simple. Just grab rocks or balls from the ground and throw. Aim in the head, trust me. But there's one important thing. You can make him lose you. Just stay out of his sight. Run in the opposite direction he's moving. Use headphones to your footsteps. If he will lose you, he will start taking shit's friendly round. At the shit bomb when he's close. You're welcome. What? Okay, I'm... This is gonna be a trial and error. It's literally a boss fight. It's a shit monster, isn't it? What the? No, it's the pig king. Oh. Okay, ow. It's literally a boss fight. Okay. Oh, I forgot. You don't hold it. You just press it. I know the note said Pig King before, but I wasn't expecting an actual Pig King. Oh, now. Come on, grab it. There we go. We almost have him a half, but oh, we're almost dead. What? What? I was pressing left click. Oh, I guess I needed to right click. Okay, I guess I was supposed to right click, not left click. Now, bottles well. Yep. Oh, I got him! Oh, I guess I used the... <laughs> well, that worked. Okay. Oh, I get free choices. Pick up the crown, leave with the toilet, or get on the toilet. Um, oh, I guess I gotta use numbers. Uh. I guess we'll complete our original mission, leave with the toilet. Hello? Is anyone there? I'm Jack. I'm stuck here. We can help you. Tell us what happened. I was bit of this, a bit of that, a bit of I've everything. Got heavy stuff here. I need help with getting it out of there. What is that heavy stuff? It's the golden toilet. Okay, wait there. We're coming. Yeah, it's not going to be easy to move. Shit! Phew. I really need to pet some cats now. <laughs> yeah, but here comes the chopper. Take a chopper. Take it this golden toilet hole. Whatever that is. Well, it's obviously Ready a toilet. To go. Pray to God this robe is stronger than my grandma's rum. Well, mission complete. <laughs> and there's a cat. Yep, now you got mm -hmm. your cats. Yep, kitties. <laughs> okay, very go. And that's one of the endings. Yep, ending two. Oh, hey, wait a minute, hold up, 13 out 13. We got all the golden toilets on our first try. See, that is awesome. <laughs> Normally I'm not that good at like finding collectibles in games, 
but hey, I got all 13 of them first try. That is amazing. Okay, now I'm going to press continue and I'm going to try and get the other two endings. So I'll see you guys when we get these other endings. Okay. The king is down once again and last part. Okay, this time we're going to do number one, get on the toilet. Oh, yeah, a golden turd we found earlier. What? What the hell happened? Um... I don't know what what happened. Do we just get transported to Narnia? Oh, that's gross. Giant turd. Dynamite! Well, I have everything needed to make this shit work. It's gonna be over now. Clearly, we have dynamite. We might want to run back. Or was I supposed to light it? Yes, it worked. Nope. Okay, what what is happening? Are we in the matrix? Or did we just fall into the back rooms? Don't tell me you fell into the back rooms. Ah, oh, great. The power goes out again. Nathan! Turn on the light! Great. He clogged the toilet again. Physical it, connecting back to the blood? first strange toilet. Wait, what? Okay, so it showed a panel, a comic panel of... Okay, so it showed a comic panel of what we saw in the first Strange Toilet game. A Nathan's girlfriend or whoever getting killed by the toilet. And the let's have fun thing. But how does that connect with this one? Is it saying that our character somehow fell into the void and became the Strange Toilet that kills the characters in the first game? I'm not entirely sure. That That's a little bit confusing there. But we still have one more ending left to get. And we already got all collectibles. So let's get that last ending, shall we? And there we go. He's down once again. So now it's time for the third. Yep. And final one. Pick up the crown. This final ending. Residents of a nearby village. Here I come to bring the peace and the long-forgotten toilets. For my name is Jack the Pig Slayer the First. <laughs> Jack the Pig Slayer. Wait, wasn't there a movie called Jack the Giant Slayer? It probably was, because Jack the Beanstalk. <laughs> okay, and with that, we've gotten all three endings, and we got all 13 of the golden uh, toilet collectibles. So, hey, we did it all in this one. I gotta admit, I like this one a lot. This was so much more expansive compared to the first one. Bigger area, a lot more to explore, collectibles, endings to get, and, and even actual boss fight at the end. And some good scares that actually did get me. This was very well made. Very well done. Good job, guys. Good job. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe since it supports me and the channel. And if you guys have any gaming recommendations at all, do leave it in the comments down below, but till then, I'll see you guys next video, stay awesome.